Good morning, everyone. Yesterday, we had a little party because uh, we are married for six years. So we thought, let's go to the shore. You know, if you are on the sailboat all the time, then uh, being on the land is special. So uh, we took our tent and everything and uh, had a nice party yesterday evening. And this morning, we baked our bread on our fire from yesterday. And uh, yeah, we the plan is to go uh, to wander around a little on this island. So we, we plan to go to the northern tip to uh, to have a look what it uh, what it looks like that's the plan see what I saw after the stand we arrived to the northern uh, side of this island and in the distance we uh, we can see our kite spot and uh, it's, uh, it's beautiful here, isn't it? Yeah, it is uh, really rough. Like there is just rocks and stone and sand. But when you sit down and just watch around you, you see all like little small animals. Like, how do you call these animals? Shells. Like in the shells and um, crabs. And there are many, many birds here. So uh, yeah, it's nice. Yeah. We are enjoying this piece of land. I think it's time to go back again, isn't it? Yeah. It starts to get warm. Yeah, and it's getting low tide, so it's kind of a challenge to get back to the boat, I think. Yalla. Yeah, the sad side of those islands in the, in the middle of the sea is all the plastic. Look at this. No one takes care of this. That's really sad. But what can you do? It's too much. I'm wondering how these shells end up here. Maybe animals are eating them, or what? Yeah, it must be quite a strong animal then. Yeah, but every, every, every shell has a, has a hole. Sometimes you see like a collection of 20 of them in yeah. one place. Maybe it could also be people, like fishermen who come here too. Yeah, could be. Wow. Huh? Is it a dolphin or is it an eel? But the back like net a dolphin back. Oh. oh, it doesn't have a fin. No, no, no. The tail is it's in eel. It's in eel. Yeah? Yeah. You don't want to meet this guy fighting you. No, we saw a few underwater, but um, they don't look very friendly. But most of the time they swim away from you. Eh? Yeah. Or they hide in a rock. <laughs> How does it end up here? I don't know. Maybe with a very no, strong wave, no. Goodbye, eel. <laughs> we arrived at the boat and uh, we uh, expected that it would be low tide, but it is very far, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, yesterday we arrived here at uh, like four hours before low tide and then the water came to here, to the edge here. And now it's two hours before low tide and it's really far away. Yep, wish us luck. And then I have to film it, so I have to walk back for the camera. <laughs> on the boat and um, for the coming week our plan is to uh, prepare for a long trip to Djibouti. Um, we probably pass Sudan because um, we, we would have to pay, well we anchor a few times but we don't enter the land because um, we would have to pay the entrance fee and everything just to stop for, uh, for a couple of days. So uh, we will pass it and go to Djibouti and I hope you enjoyed this uh, anniversary video and uh, I hope to see you Monday again. Peace out.